Outside the Supreme Court today, demonstrators on both sides of the abortion issue. Inside, justices heard arguments in a case that could significantly restrict access to mifeprestone, a commonly used abortion drug prescribed for decades. Millions of Americans have used mifepristone to safely end their pregnancies. The high court reviewing an appeals court decision restricting mifepristone access, rolling back the FDA's making the pill easier to get, including through telemedicine and by mail. We are asking the Supreme Court to hold the FDA accountable for violating the law to the detriment of women's health. The group of anti-abortion doctors leading the legal challenge claims the FDA did not adequately evaluate the drug's safety risks and wants the high court to limit access even in states where abortion remains legal. The risks are extremely minimal. It's extremely safe. The FDA says the pill has been safe and effective since its approval in 2000. And the pharmaceutical industry is cautioning. Undermining FDA's approval process won't stop at mifeprestone. It would upend not just mifeprex, but virtually every drug approval. Justices appeared skeptical of the challenge the anti-abortion doctors made. They're saying because we object to having uh, to be forced to participate in this procedure, we're seeking an order preventing anyone from having access to these drugs at all. The Supreme Court is allowing full access to the drug while the legal proceedings play out. Susan McGinnis, NBC News, Washington.